Okay, have a crack here. Welcome back to the channel, and yeah, welcome back for another TGC 2019 course playthrough. All right, so if my if my voice sounds a little bit funny, it's because I've been smashed with like hay fever or a flu or something. So it might sound a little bit funnier than usual. All right, so today's course we have Lake Lila, and it's designed by one of my personal favourite designers of the game, Baby Bull, aka Michael Connor. Alright, so let's get into it. What do we got? Fairways are firm, greens are normal, green speed is medium to fast, everything else is default. As for the tees, we will be, we will be going all the way from the black tees at 6,481 yards. So yeah, we'll um, go ahead and rip out the old crack cam and start smacking a few balls around. Alright, let's get out there. Alright, here we are. Let's rip up the old camera and go and have a little bit of a look around oh what do we got here actually look at this oh wow so now see why I see I say he's one of my um favorite designers look at that would you look at that view that is absolutely bloody beautiful so yeah it plays around right around a big lake here a um, rock lined lake that is I'll be baby bull is um, known for his rock work he, he loves his rocks loves his rocks all right so yeah let's get over here and um let's check out the old clubhouses oh look at this look at that nice little water feature out the front there very very big clubhouse nice car park out the back you can see the road coming all the way in down there wow this looks absolutely insane. Oh, we got a driving range down here as well. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's go for a wander around the course. Let's, um, let's go backwards. We'll go around this way because I want to check out this absolutely stunning retaining wall he's got here. Look at that. That is insane. And the rock work. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, nice little um, water feature over here. Oh, let's have a fly up this. Let's go and check out this. Look at this. That is absolutely stunning. Look at the planting and everything on this course. In the rocks and everything. That is, yeah, unreal. Absolutely unreal. Nice little water source up there for the waterfalls. All right, let's, um, let's go ahead and wander down this way. Now, I did say in the description you can either stay at the old... Um, the old clubhouse or he does have a few houses along the lake or like some cabins that you can rent out and everything like that uh, come stay for a night and have a swing absolutely stunning look at this you can see why he's um, definitely one of my favorite designers now this is only his fourth course into this game as well mind you he does um he's not long released um was it Toby's Rock for the CC Design Competition? Wow. Oh, look at this. All up the back here as well. Beautiful cart path all the way around. Lovely choice of um, planting that shows off some nice colour and everything like that. Oh, we got down in here. You've got a nice little, um, nice little water feature here down by the toilet block. So if we turn back around here, we head back in this way. Again with the houses, or the, the, the um, cabins I should say. Every cabin has got a wharf out there, out the front as well. Look at that. How picturesque is that? Could you imagine just sitting down on here? We can just get down, or just, just even looking over the, look at that, look at that for a view. Just waking up in the morning before you're around. Checking out the view. Alright, what a stunning sight. Wow, this course looks absolutely beautiful. Look at it, all the way around. Oh, what do we got down here? Some more rock work. He did, um, did um, let me know about this course as well. and did say he was going for a bit more of a natural look about this one too so still very nice oh what's this down in here oh 
a nice little eating area and stuff like that. Maybe wake up in the morning, sit out there and have a coffee and stuff. But wow, absolutely stunning. Love his work. Absolutely love it. I'll, um, in my description below, I'll, I'll list um, the courses that he's got out just in case some of his haven't played them or anything. I, I highly recommend that you go and check them out. You will not be disappointed. Oh, absolutely beautiful. Let's um, let's pull right up and have a look at the plot here. Let's see what we've got. Look at that. Look at all that. Plays around the big rock-lined lake. Oh, he's got a bit, bit more of a um, water feature down in here as well. Nice little bridge work. That is absolutely beautiful. Very nice. Look at that. Wouldn't that make a wouldn't that make a good um good thumbnail right there or something like that? I'll have to come back and take a screenshot. Again with the water source as well. For the old um, little waterfalls and everything like that. Alright, let's wander back down here. Wow, this is going to be an awesome round. Well, it's an awesome course. I'm not going to say I'm going to play well because I have brought out the Master Clubs again. And yeah, but oh, look at the, the, just the planting and the way he blends these rocks in and everything like that. Absolutely stunning. All right, let's just um, take one more little look. We'll just head over to the clubhouse here. Have one more little look over the whole course. Just do like a we'll just pan around we'll just pan around right from here look at this what a view what a view all right all right can we get down to the first team start smacking a few balls let's get into it all right here we are back at hole one par four 430 yards 35 i should say <laughs> sorry it's the whole flu is affecting my brain and everything at the moment. So yeah, I don't feel the best, but I really want to do um, show this course off. All right, let's go. So yeah, with the Master Clubs, this could be a bit shaky. We've got eight mile wins, not too bad at all. Let's point it just about here. Right, let's have a little bit of a warm up. Oh, perfect, perfect. Now I. I do feel that I'm slowly getting the use to these clubs. It is nothing like the old Xbox, I can tell you. You've got to be a lot more patient with your swing. Alright, so what have we got here? 126, 13 feet up. A little bit of wind as well. Might bump that up to the old pitch and wedge. I really think the wind is going to get a hold of this. So if we just move out here a little bit. I'm not going to count it at the moment. I think about there. Probably need to go out a bit more than this, but we are quite close to the green. A little bit of a fast on the backswing. That should be coming around nicely, though. Sit down. Ooh, that's not too bad. I'll happily take that one. Oh, that's a nasty, that's a nasty break, isn't it? All right, so what do we got? Slight two inches up. Bit of a nasty break to the right here. Oh, is it going? No, it's not. No, it's not. Just on the inside. All right, so we might come out with a nice little par on this. Well, that's what I'm kind of hoping. Just like that. There was a bird up there too. Now that's not an easy thing to put into a course. The old birds, so I've heard. Alright, hole two, par three, hundred and thirty-seven yards. Playing right down by the lake here. Okay, what do we got? Oh, again, eleven mile winds. Pitching wedge. 
Do we play the nine on this? Oh, it's got a bit of a run. I think we'll go the pitching wedge. It is five feet down to the pin. It's got a bit of a downhill run all the way to the um to the hole here, so. Oh man, has that gone right? Okay, maybe should have played the nine. Yep, learn from your mistakes. Um, okay. Oof. Well, I've really got to re get rid of those numbers off the screen. I can hardly see where the hole is there. Eh? Right, this is going to have a run to it. This is going to have a huge run. All right, so there's the hole. So if we bring it out here a bit. Just give it a nice little tap. Oh, come in, come in, come in. Get in the hole, get in the hole, get in the hole. Oh, what a putt. What a putt. That is a birdie. All right, one under. Coming into the third hole, par five. 528 yards. Wow, that's probably going to be the part of the part of the day, actually. Wow, absolutely beautiful course, bunker work, path work is yeah, absolutely stunning. What a beautiful part of the course here. All right, so ten miles, nine miles now in our face, pretty much. Let's point it straight down the middle here. Ooh, that was a better swing. That was a hell of a better swing. Alright, so nine miles now. What have we got? Fifteen feet up. Ooh, three wood. What is it? It is a par five, so we could play short on this. I think that's what we. I think I might just do that. I think I might go the, t the old two iron into this one. Just sort of lay it up just in front of the green. Oh, ripped it fast, but the wind should keep that in check. Hopefully. Oh, actually, we're going to get a bounce onto the green. Oh, look at this, would you? Oh, what a lovely kick onto the green there. And the flag comes into sight as well. This could be an eagle here, people. This could be an eagle. Oh, get out. Get out. That is an eagle. All right. Let's keep going. Loving this at the moment. All right, hole four, par four. 282 yards. Okay, seems like a um, quite a short par four here. Well, let's drive it. Let's go for it. Seven miles in our face. Oh, I ripped the fast into it. How is that fast? Seriously, if I was back on the Xbox right now, oh, come back on, come back on, get on. If I was on the Xbox right now, that would have been an almighty slow on that front swing. Alright, uh, Lobbert's chip, I might put some high loft into this one. It will definitely put some high loft into it. I'm going to aim straight at it. Yeah, slightly left. Oh, here we go. This is going to be a bird. Oh, yes it is. Wow. I think I'm going to have to start using this course as a warm-up. All right, hole five, par three hundred and eighty-two yards. There's the pin. 
Let's go for it. Again, eight miles coming at us. Ooh, seven iron. Yeah, it might not be too bad, actually. What's the green doing? Ooh, it's all running down. I think the eight iron's not going to get there. I think it's just going to land in front of the green here. Oh, seven feet down. Oh, you never know. You never know. Well, that's not a bad swing. Not a bad swing. That is slightly going left of the hole, though. Is it going to make it? No, I didn't think it would. I didn't think that was going to get up either. Right, should have stuck with the old um, seven on that one. All right, lob wedge chip again. Let's put some high loft on this. I'll just give it max high loft. Oh, okay. This is um, yeah, too much high loft. Oh, this is a nasty putt. This could be bogey. This could definitely be bogey here. I just want to tap this too. I do not want this to roll too far past the hole. When I miss it, that is. Oh, move your shoulder. Can't see. Oh! That was close too. That was very close. Alright, we pick up our first bogey of the day. Purely because of my um, bad judgment. On the the um on the tee there, actually it could be a double. Looking at this, I'm not the best at putting. Oh yeah, throw it, mate. Do it. Go for it. We got plenty. We've got plenty. I brought spares. Oh wow, double bogey. You're joking. That's not good. Back to two under. All right, hole six, par five. Let's put that last one behind us. Uh, what do we got? 550 yards. There's the pin all the way down the end. All right, 10 miles pushing out to the left here. Oh, that was a good strike too. That was a beautiful tee off. Alright, so 10 miles again, still going with us. Um, two iron. Ooh. Honestly, bringing in with the three. What have we got? That's our lie here. Oh, this could be a little bit too much still, too. I'll actually put a little bit of high loft on this three. Oh, that's a fast, fast. Oh, come around to the hole, baby. Come around. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, did we overcook that. We came in like a duck shot in the ass on that one. Oh, wow, that's going to push all the way to the back. Get off, get off, get off, get off. Thank you. Alright, sand wedge. Let's actually bump that back to the lob wedge. Oh, lob wedge flop. Not the best at this. Oh, damn. I did not want backspin right there. Alright, slide uphill. Breaking right here. I'll come around. Get in, get in. Ah. Oh. So we pick up a par on that one. Absolutely cracking start. And yeah, again, falling apart. 
All right, hole seven, par four, 435 yards. All right, where's the pin? Oh, is that the pin out to the right on this one? What a beautiful looking hole though. Ooh, we got nine miles going with us. We could smash it straight down here, I reckon. Oh, fast on the backswing. Yep. That's going to work in my favour, though. Wow, what a very nice course. Very playable. Even though I just sort of stuffed those last two holes. Um, all right, so what have we got? 75, three up. Let's drop that back to the gap wedge here. I'll put just a tad little bit high loft on the gap wedge. It's like a security blanket for me. Let's actually bring it back here a bit. Okay, I was hoping, I was kind of hoping that was going to go right, but looking at my swing, now I know why it went left. And down you go. That's another birdie. Ripper, back to three under. All right, hole eight, par 352 yards. And we got six mile wins. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Learn that little trick from old um, Sam on Twitch. Let's hope it works out. Might, might stick with the nine on this one. Oh, it's coming back. It's coming round. It's coming round. Kick on. Damn it. That was my swing. Again, fast on the back swing. And yeah, push that one right. All right, let's, um, I want to actually max, put max high loft on this. I've got a feeling this is going to go past the hole here. I really don't like take, taking um, taking power out of my swings on the PC at the moment. I haven't quite got the gist of that. Oh, I just did then. Yeah, everything reacts totally different. pick up a nice little par there anyway so yeah if you haven't um got over to um twitch and catched old sam playing him in um was it in flames old um bavakia and katana mike they always play some nice skins rounds on there so yeah it's always good to watch so yeah by all means pop over and tell them have a crack send you and say good day you can catch me in the chat over there as well yeah Absolutely brilliant play from him all as well. Very good players. Good to watch. Um, all right. Let's um, point it straight down here. Now, this is downhill, isn't it? This is downhill. Hopefully, we don't overcook this and go right to the end. Ah, oh, fast backswing. Shit! That's in the shaggy carpet. Oh, I've got to slow my swings down. Got to slow them down. I've got to have that slight little pause at the top. Alright, so playing out of the rough. Let's bump that up. Let's come in with the three on this one. Looking at the green. That's all sloping down to the right. Uphill. Makes it sound like I know what I'm doing here. where that wind is going to push us so and my swing god knows where that could go oh 
Oh, we need to jump up more. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh. There it is. Oh, no. Oh, where is... Oh, shit. Let's do that again. Let's do that again. I'm absolutely destroying his course right now. Let's jump up again. Let's go the two iron. That look better. Let's put it out this way this time. Very fast. You're kidding. How was that very fast? If I had it gone any slower, seriously. Well, yep, the wheels have fallen off. Oh my god, so what does that put me now? Oh, you're joking. Back to 200. I've had two bogeys or double bogeys on the front nine already. On this such a beautiful course too. Alright, hole 10. Par 4, 412 yards. There's the pin in the distance there. Oh my god, my swing is just like... It's just gone to pieces like the rest of me. So, eight miles are coming at us. Let's jump that up to the nine. Let's put a bit of high loft on it. There we go. That was better. That's it, come around. That dug in. What was the what was the green firmness again? Or the the um, firmness of the course? I can't remember. All right, downhill putt here. Again, just want to tap this for when I miss it. Oh, you're joking! Only just two. Fist pump and par it is. Okay, hole 11, par 3, 128 yards. Ooh, look at this one. Look at this. Uh, what do we got? Gat wedge. No, we're bumping that up. Let's go to the pitching wedge. Might even have to go a bit more on this. Oh, it's 13, 13 feet down to the pin, though. Still got a feeling that wind's going to hold us up a bit. Oh man, did I push that way left with the old fast front swing on that? Alright, so what do we got? Uphill. And that's going to break a lot quicker the closer we get to the hole here. To turn in, turn in. Oh, that, I've overhit that. Oh, have I? Oh, ho, ho, you're kidding. You're kidding. Thought I was going to go around the, right around the hole and come back. Wow, what a stunning view, though. Look at that. Let's just, he's just going to check it out for a moment. Okay, um, hole 12, par 5, 522 yards. Just let this one fly along here just a little bit. Yeah, very, very, very nice course. Very nice. Bunker work is beautiful. 
All right, five miles coming at us. I'm a little disappointed though that this wasn't a desert theme course, but oh well. No, nah, just joking, mate. Just joking. <laughs> uh, baby Bill would get what I'm talking about there. Um, all right, so what are we got here? 234, eight feet up to the pin. Bit of wind. Is a par five. We could go for the green, which might in turn shoot it over a bit here. Or we could just lay up in front. Um, I'm kind of thinking we'll just go the two iron. Let's just put it in front. Let's try and play a little bit smarter, considering the way I am playing at the moment. All my shots, I should say. Oh, that was a good one. That was a nice, that was a sweet shot, that. chip, eh? Nine iron chip, you say? Can we change that? Log wedge. Chip. Pitch. Uh, let's go back up. Punch. Sandwich chip. Alright, nine iron chip it is. After playing around with the club, let's, um, Oh, that's running. That's running. That's running. That's why I didn't want to use a 9-9. I could have put a bit of high loft on that. Didn't even think about that. Again, brain's all clouded at the moment. Oh, downhill putt. That's breaking hellishly left. Oh, oh where is it? There it is. No, he's missed that. Oh, okay, get in the hole, what was that for, that was a par wasn't it, a par on a par 5, absolutely disgraceful, but that's how I usually do it, alright hole 13, par 4, 324 yards, so started absolutely strong, I thought to myself, oh yes, this is going to be an absolute cracker of a round. Oh, actually, that's, that's, that fast is working in my favour here. Get on the green. Get up to the hole. Oh, I kind of feel like I'm losing my voice at the moment. Okay, uphill putt. Just gonna wing it here. Already got 13 inches up. Give that a bit of a tap. Oh, get to, to get go. Oh, you're joking. I thought that was going. I thought that was going. All right. Another little birdie on the back nine. No, oh, actually, first birdie on the back nine, to be honest. All right, back to three under. A bit of a colourful scorecard there. I think we've got all colours going, happening at the moment. All right, um, hole 14, par three, 175 yards. All right, what have we got? 11 mile wins. Wow, all righty. Um... Eight iron. Seven, that's going to come in really hot. So we've got, oh, we got one, two, three, four, seven, about, about there. I'm going to say that's if I nail this swing, I am going to put a little bit of low loft on this. Oh, 
why did that go so left? I compensated for the wing. The swing line's pretty, pretty straight towards the top. All right, uphill, break and right. Come in, come in. Oh, again, so close. If I could just start nailing these parts. Okay, all right, what are we up to? Hole 15, par five, is it? Yes, it is. 541 yards. What a view, what a view. Tell you what, I reckon Baby Bull has some of the best rock work that I've seen, eh? Absolutely stunning. Ooh, that gets a bit narrow, doesn't it? That gets a bit narrow down there. We could play up near the bunkers or down near the water. I say the water, eh? Oh, look at that. That was a dead set perfect swing, that one. For me. Could have been a little bit straighter at the bottom. Alright, what have we got? 16 feet up. 220. Bit of wind. Come in with the three. What's the green doing? It's all uphill. Oh, we're going to overcook that. Let's put a little bit of low loft on the, um, the old three. So come around, come around, come on, come on. Actually, that wasn't too bad. I'm quite happy with that shot, to be honest. Oh, another downhill part here. Do not like my downhill parts. Oh, go, go, go! Yes! There we go. Oh, that was an eagle. Another eagle. All right, let's see if we can keep away from those red numbers on the back nine. All right, hole 16, par four, 423 yards. Playing towards the beautiful waterfalls here. All right, 10 miles going with us. Can we make that gap? Can we make it? I think we can. It's all slightly downhill. We do have that wind. Let's aim for that meaty part right there on the fairway. Come on, good swing. Come on, good swing. Ah, there's a fast. That actually might not be too bad. Is it going to push all the way to the edge? Oh, no. Oh, I just noticed too, there's... Is there a... Is there a first cut there? I don't think it is. It just goes straight to rough, doesn't it? It's the first, to the first time I've noticed that. Oh, no, sorry. It is. It's just a light rough, and that'd be a, that'd be a heavy rough. Yep, yeah, okay. Brain's turned to shit. Um, all right. Sandwich, what have we got? Seven feet up. Gap wedge. Is that wind going to come into play? I don't think it's going to come into play that much here. Might put some put some high loft on it though. Oh, 
maybe that wind did come into play there. Just when you think it's not going to. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. And it's hard to predict sometimes. Is that, is that, oh, that's another birdie. All right, six under. Here we go. All right, hole 17, par 3, 173 yards. Look at this. Look at this. What a cracking looking hole. Love the bunker works too. Very nice. And yeah, the planting. Beautiful. Um, all right, so what do we got? 169, one foot up. Yeah, a little bit of wind. I don't think. Oh, will the. I think we'll play the seven on this one. We might end up overshooting this a bit though. Let's put a little bit of high loft on it. Got under that beautifully. Get at the hole. Sit down. Yeah, had a feeling we're gonna um overshoot that a bit. Oh, that's left me with a dangerous downhill putt this. This is a doozy. Just gonna put it out here somewhere. Just gonna put the hole right behind my ass. And let's just give it a nice little tap. Oh, that's it. Slow up. Ease up. Ease up. Woo, woo, woo. Look at that view, though. Again. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, he's missed it. He's missed it. Oh my god, I can't believe it. There it is. We've put a red number on the back nine. You're joking. Oh, man. Wow. What time is it? It's like 1.30 in the morning right now. <laughs> uh, i got to go to bed. All right, here we go. Last hole. 18th hole, par five. 546 yards. Absolutely beautiful course. I've, I've really enjoyed this. Had some ups, had some downs. Yeah, very, very nice. All right, nine miles. Let's poke it about there. Oh, that's headed for the bunker. That's headed. Oh, it's going to pull up, is it? Kick in, kick in, stop. Oh, sh All right, rolled nicely into the bunker there. He's not liking it. He's not liking this shot. Oh, I don't know about that hit. That hill right there in front of us. Should we go for this? We could two iron it. I think we're going to catch that that mound right there, though. This could be dangerous. This could be very, very dangerous. It is a par five, so I think I might just five iron it. This could be very dangerous. Oh no, we got there, we got there. Possibly could have went with the two, maybe? I was playing a course earlier where I thought I could get out of a bunker like that, and yeah, clipped the hill right right in front of me and shot way up in the, up in the air and Landed just behind me. Alright, so what do we got? 40 yards. 11 feet up here. This is going to put a bit of backspin on it. It's the only way you get backspin in this game is to um, yeah, hit off a incline like that. So I've noticed. Okay. Oh, 
downhill part, another downhill part. Just tap it in. Oh yes, look at that view. Let's just soak it up a bit. All right, well there you go, another birdie. Six under, what a colorful scorecard. Score Can't even speak properly now. Well, that was, that was a good round. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Thoroughly enjoyed the course, as per usual from Baby Bull. Absolutely outstanding designer. Ooh, we've got some new club heads, nice. All right, well, there you have it, Lake Lila. And again, that was created by Baby Bull, or as you can see right there, Michael Connor, 22. That is definitely getting a favorite. I'm coming back to this course for sure. All right, there we go. Boom and done. So yeah, if you do like this, by all, all means, smash that thumbs up, smash around that subscribe, and yeah, I'll catch you again on another course somewhere, and hopefully not in a bunker. Alright, later.